Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I've got a really exciting um, share, well something very exciting to share with you. I purchased a wild hair kit. I'm just going to move this a little bit because that's irritating me. Um, so I purchased this from the internet. I'd seen loads of YouTube videos of people um, purchasing these kits. They are curated for you um, on the basis of questions that you answer on their website. Um, and you can give specific details and then they're put together for you based on what you like. So it's not the case that everyone would receive the same kit. It's dependent on the comments that you make. I'm going to add uh, in here a few screenshots of the things that I asked for. But um, I typically use stamps, uh, stickers and um, like label stickers and things like that. What I use the most. Um, so I just ticked some of the um, particular embellishments that I tend to use in layouts and then there was a gap for you to write in some of your current projects so I did talk about the fact that I had um, selected sparkle as my word for one little word um, and so I would appreciate anything related to that that could be put in and told them about a few other projects that I had going on as well as I say I'll insert some screenshots here so that you can see them so this is the kit, I haven't actually properly looked at it, I've just undone the thing because it was really well wrapped. <laughs> it just comes in this envelope, it was delivered by Royal Mail here to the UK. The um, postage is quite expensive but it's not like a monthly sign up so you can just order them when you like and I'd seen that there was quite a lot of, there were quite a lot of things in the pack and I thought it would be a bit of fun. Um, so let me just drag this out. <laughs> okay so I need to cover that up really. So there's a little note here and it says, Hi Sam, this kit is loaded with lots of bright vibrant colours. I built your kit around the Chamel Talk It Up paper which says sparkle. I included some sparkly stickers and alphas and made sure to include some pink paisley Paige Evans products. I also sent you some 6x6 sheets, cut aparts and versatile phrase chipboard. Lastly I included our exclusive January cut file. Enjoy, Alison. Oh my kitty aunt, it looks amazing. This looks so good. This looks like something I'm really going to love. Oh my god, look at it. Okay. Oh, I'm so excited. I was really nervous about it because you just don't know if you gave. I was thinking, oh, did I give enough information? Are they going to be able to kind of get from this what I like? Um, but I'm, this is a very promising start. So if I just take this off here. And I'm going to pull this out of here and have a little look. Happy crafting, Alison, that's so cute. Look! Oh, thank you. <laughs> so, some papers, these are gorgeous. I wonder what they're from. It probably tells you on that sheet, actually. I'll have a look in a second. They're really pretty. Oh, I like that with the little clouds. They're really pretty. Definitely be able to use some of those in my project life. Ooh, 100%. In fact, I've got a spread I'm doing right this second that I stopped because the postman turned up and this would be really good for that. Oh look at these puffy puffy stickers. Oh I love puffy stickers. So pink fresh studio puffy stickers. Mm, BU. Oh it's so cute. Eyes like a shutter, heart like a lens. Mm, I'm so very happy. Oh my gosh these will definitely get used. And teacups. I love teacups. Oh my god. I've never seen these before. Look how cute these are. Pink Paisley, pick me up. Oh my giddy aunt, they're so nice. Look, these little sequins and little brollies and flowered buttons and then these like little tag things down here. These will be so cute. I'm working on a project right now these will be amazing for. So that's great. I did say I like stamps um, and I don't have this roller stamp so that's really good news shine on oh that would be so good for my um what is it called one little word album oh these are so good i love roller stamps so much i've got so many now so i was a little bit nervous when i said i like stamps i thought i better get a roller stamp and i hope it isn't one i've already got <laughs> but it isn't so that's good news and um, some puffy stickers and no what are these called thickers even and they're glittery I don't know if you can you can see that look at that oh yeah glitter Woo sparkly 
American Crafts and they're called Fancy. They're really nice, I love those. They'll be great. And this is a Project Life chipboard set, which is great. Oh, I can definitely use these in Project Life. These are so good. They'll be really, really useful. Cute, bright colours, loving that. And then, oh, it's so sparkly. Chamel Glitter Girl. Look at those unicorns. Oh my gosh, I just love that so much. Free Spirit. Oh, it's just awesome and it's like things I wouldn't really pick I don't even though this is cool I would think oh it looks really good but when would I use it but now that I have it oh, I could definitely use that then it came with a cut file I've seen this on that other people had and I have been saving my 2018 cover page for project life uh, until I received this I'm 100% gonna be able to use this and it's got this little leftover 2018 thingy from the inside of there I would I don't have any kind of silhouette so I wouldn't be able to make one of these for myself so this is going to be amazing last year I spent ages cutting 2017 out round a little piece of paper with a um what are they even called craft knife but it took me ages so this will save me a job so that's great thank you for that hmm this is cool black and white so I liked black and white oh my gosh I love this it's like little phones. Good vibes. Shine on. You got this. BFF. Oh, I can use these. I can cut these out. I really love this side, but I can so badly use these. In fact, these are all hashtag ones. I could totally cut these out. Oh, this paper is going to be amazing. I already have this paper. So, this is. Oh, sorry. What is this one from? Pebbles Girl Squad. Love it. Um, BU. Oh, I've got one like this, but I don't think it might be a pink fresh, but I don't think it's from this collection because it isn't this on the other side. But I'm sure I've got one that's really similar to that if it's not exactly the same. Um, yeah, that's cute. I think I've got this paper or I've seen it. Mm, I might have this one, but this is really cute. I love floral cutter parts. I think I said that in my um, bit. Oh, and this side is nice as well with the yellow. Yeah, it's Chamel little by little. I'm pretty sure I do have that one. Ooh, geometric black and white. Awesome. Oh, this is cute too. A case of the blahs. <laughs> and this is pink fresh. I love pink fresh. Yeah, it's so good. Oh, cut apart. Chamel glitter girl. You can change the world. Oh, look at that. It's so cute these are oh I love that side too I actually really love like clashing -y kind of really bright colours like that and another cut apart I love cut aparts capture life um, which is really cute oh and it's glittery on this so it's Alison Creft never heard of her Echo Park uh, love this mmm I do love it <laughs> <gasps> Oh my goodness, this is so cute. Sparkle, 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 sparkle. Oh, I'm going to cut those out. <laughs> oh, but look at that side. That is so cool. That's amazing. And then another kind of floral that I could definitely cut apart. Gorgeous. So gorgeous. Oh, I just love it. Which, this one is Jamel Gliss Girl and this bottom one is Stargazer. Dear Lizzie. Oh, look. Oosh, I just love this. I'm going to spend hours cutting these out. <laughs> and I absolutely adore this one. This is so good. I'm going to look for more of these. Pebbles Girl Squad. I could totally use this stuff. Um, yeah, that was amazing. This is really useful. So useful. And then Glitter Girl. Look at it. Mm, that's so cool. Sorry, I'm just going quiet and staring at things like a weirdo. But I'm really, really impressed with these things. There's a lot of things I wouldn't have bought, necessarily. Um, just because I would be too wimpy to think about how I would use them. Uh, but I am absolutely in love with this. So I'll do a few layouts using some of these um, products. And if you haven't got the Wild Hair Kit, I would 
I would recommend it as a bit of fun to try out and then uh, to be honest on the basis of this I would I would use it again I would definitely order it again I think you get quite a lot um, for your money it's just the, the postage to the UK it's not cheap it's about $20 um, which I suppose is like 16 I guess it's like 16 how maybe um, and the kit itself is about $38 I think I'll make sure I link everything down below and give you the kind of price in the UK as to what I spent on it um, but it's fun it's a bit of fun it's not economical if you're in the UK really but it's fun interesting and yeah just really cool to kind of give a little hint of you and see how it turns out and I'm really impressed with how they've done because yeah they've definitely met my brief more than so I'm gonna have loads of fun with this okay um yeah if you've got wild hair kits uh leave a comment below I'd really love to know how you felt they did for you um I am impressed but I had seen some YouTube videos where people were a bit disappointed my advice would be to make sure you give some real details about things you really like and I did leave comments of things that I really don't like like I don't like vintage style um, I don't like browns or oranges or creams I prefer white bright colors floral patterns geometric patterns and I prefer finer print patterns rather than large patterns on my paper unless it's floral in which case I want it to be big so I can cut it out so I did leave details like that I talked about specific things I would like specific ranges that I liked and I really think that that's paid off because I've got something that I wouldn't necessarily pick for myself but that um I really really love and I can definitely get some use out of so thanks for watching see you again in the next video thumbs up subscribe if you want to see more and yeah leave comments let me know how you've got on with these kinds of kits or if you would um, like to have a go. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye!